Okay, welcome everybody. Today in this video, we're gonna be talking about the relaunch of VegasCure.com. I'm very excited to announce that when you log in to Vegas Cure in the future, you will now have a completely revamped dashboard. It's gonna be presented as a software package that gives you the ability to go and get all the information in one place and really present it to you in a really accessible and very straightforward manner. I'm really more than excited. I'm really, I don't even know how to say, super excited. And the reason I'm so excited is because the kind of framework that we've developed for Vegas Cure is really informed by our one-to-one -one coaching relationships that we have with all of our clients. In the last few years, we've developed an incredible software that's that's an in-house software that we use with all of our clients. And so now I said, what if everybody in Vegas Cure could have access to the same type of software dashboard as a read-only? You're not going to be able to change anything if, unless you're in a, in, a, in, a, in a paid program. But as a free program goes for Vegas Cure, it's really remarkable. And... We also have updates on the specific devices and some really exciting announcements that mean that if you have ever seen Vegas Care and you saw that in the past you had to make a modification to the ear clips, we now have the link to the pair of ear clips that are already assembled. So if you want to go out and buy an even updated, revamped, very affordable, I believe it's only $10, you can now go and get a brand new, just released ear clip system for using with your microcurrent simulator. So hang tight, I'm gonna pull up on the screen what that looks like here. And you guys, I want you to start taking notes and get really excited, okay? I'm, this is like, this is a you know long term in the making, really excited to release this. This is gonna be the modification to VegasCure.com that's gonna let you say, hey, I really want you to consider checking out VegasCure.com. Send it to your friends. Send it to family members. Check it out yourself. If you're not already in a, in a coaching program, um, and if you're just here new to the group, and you wanna, you're want you like, I want to try some vagus nerve stimulation. I'm risk averse enough that I could probably stimulate my vagus nerve, and I'm not really that concerned. I understand that it's a, you know, it's a new technology, but it's really safe, you guys. It's actually really, really, really safe. A lot of people are doing it already. There's probably about, I would say, maybe about 100,000 people around the world right now who are doing some form of electrical stimulation of their ear with a specific type of device. Um, you know, since we since we announced in 2019, um, just the links to the devices that we've made, I've talked to the manufacturer, and they've said every time you mention the Vegas Cure course, our sales of that specific device shoot through the roof. So you guys are taking action. You guys for certainly are, are, are action takers, which I'm really excited about. That's really all I care about. I don't need the whole world following. I, I don't need the whole world here. Um, what, I, what I really want to uh, accumulate are people who are able to take action on simple steps to in, improve their health. That's what this is all about. So you guys ready? Let's put a two in the chat. If you want to see the behind the scenes reveal of what Vegas Cure looks like now. Let's see some ones in the chat. Let's get excited. Everybody here watching as well on YouTube, make sure you just nod your head and put a thumbs up in the air and say, I'm ready. Okay, I want to make sure you guys are ready for this. We got a little delay on the video. I see some twos coming in. That's fantastic. So type a two in the chat. I want to see all you ramped up. Okay, cool. We got some twos. Great. Fantastic. And as those come in, I'm going to share the screen and show you behind the scenes of what Vegas Cure looks like now. Okay? And so how easy it is to actually start finding the information. And we're going to do a kind of a, a really interesting synopsis of how to start thinking about systems of health. This is something that I teach to clients all the time. It's game changing. You'll see people in the chat going, well, this has really been a really revelation for me in terms of how I think about how to approach my health. So it's not just a course on, it's not just a video repository for, you know, here's the link, go buy this. But it's a course, it's an online course that teaches you how to do things. But it's also a way to frame how, how you think about your health that makes it manageable. I just want you to quickly, before I show this, raise your hand in the air if dealing with all the influx of information can sometimes feel like overwhelming, right? Raise your hand if that's ever happened to you. You're like, it's not that we're short of information 
on the internet, right? There's tons of information. You can go find everything that I share in the Facebook group is generally speaking going to be available to you. Of course, I put my own spin on it and we'll, we'll basically uh, put my smart my smarts to it. But it can be overwhelming. If some people just join from the summit that just happened where I was a, a guest speaker, you learn probably from maybe 40 different people. And there's lots of good stuff to share there, but is it? it's not provided, honestly, in a, in a format that's action-oriented per se. It's just kind of like, here's my bleh, vomit of information, and then I'm going to ask you to go and sign up with one of my programs. That's what you see in these summits. You saw, um, you know, Evan... Uh, Evan Williams, I believe, um, you saw Dr. Motley, and while they're sharing really great information, it's not ever in a container where the links are there to take action. You have to basically kind of like, you have to do a lot of the extra work, and it just becomes more and more headache. It becomes more research. So I thought in, in light of that, given how complex this world could be, could I present the information that shifts how you think about health? So that it no longer becomes a sense of urgency or delusion. It now becomes a level of fulfillment where you can do it on your time, at your pace, when you want to. And it's all there and it's all simplified. Um, and so I'm like, this could be a great value add. So now that I've built up some level of excitement, as you're supposed to do in the marketing world, I'm going to share on screen the dashboard for it. Now, don't let its simplicity fool you, folks. Okay? Okay. You, if you, if the simplicity makes you think, well, there's not much here, just wait until I start expanding where the information is located. This is an, a foldered, expanded, uh, uh, nested hierarchy of information. So if you think of it, if you think of it, it's a filed away system that enables you to access based on specific questions you have and based on specific progressions and based on specific needs. Whereas it's not going to be one of these vomits all over the page of tons of information all at once. This is going to be based on what you need to focus on right now. Okay, so here we go. Let's share the screen and let me re shrink it so you can see it all. Boom and boom. There we go. Good. Okay. So we're going to kind of show our tabs there and we got it in the screen. I kind of got to make it so you don't have to see all my tabs, but okay, there we go. Okay. So, uh, three in the chat, if you can see this on your screen well enough. Okay. Three in the chat. If this is visible to you, I just want to make sure everybody can see it. Okay. And at times I will be, I will be zooming in to specific, um, items. So what you're going to see is that this is a white label service that we have used to organize the information. The website that it's, that it's co-hosted with a, a partner vendor is called ClickUp. And so that's a space that we are utilizing in order to, um, have, uh, you know, just this incredible backend software to make sure that it's all, that it all works, you know? Um, that was one of the issues with Vegas Cure was it was built on software that doesn't have a, you know, much of a, a process behind it. It's very simple, uh, you know, uh, repository of information. This is an interactive system, um, which makes it more powerful. So what you're going to see here is the Vegas Cure coaching space. And as I go through, I'm going to just kind of show you what the first thing you're going to do. So you're going to see in the capture list, captured tasks. So anytime you have a task or a to-do item, some of the things that are unorganized, you're going to just see them here. So first thing you're going to see is welcome. Click here and watch this video first. So we're going to click on this and you're going to see it's going to open up. Okay. And it's going to, it's going to show you a video on your screen. Okay. And the first video is going to be th basically this video that you're watching right now. So I'm actually recording the video to put in here. Okay. Um, and so you're going to watch that video first and it's going to, it's going to be showing you everything that I'm showing you here. Now, what's really important to notice here is that we have something called body systems, okay? Now, what's really important is I want you to think in terms of there are different categories of your life. Your health and your body is a category of your life, but it's not the only category. And I'm not going to sit here and claim that stimulating your vagus nerve every day is going to necessarily increase your bank account. I'm not going to say that it's going to make your relationship with your husband or wife or partner 
necessarily better because there, there are different systems that are more focused on, you know, making money or, you know, raising your children or having a better relationship with your family. Um, now, is your health part of that situation? Is that part of the picture? Absolutely. But it's not the full thing. But stim stimulating your vagus nerve, as far as health goes, is a really good system that is located in the category of your body, okay? So what we do here is we click on this part. This is really where the magic opens up. So we click on this little carrot right here and we fold, drop down the folder and we can see the instructions first for getting and, and receiving your stimulator. So I'm gonna click on the system, stimulate my vagus nerve daily, and that's gonna pop up, okay? Now how this is organized is that I want you to think less about goals. Goals don't tell you anything about what you're supposed to do. Because you might say, my goal is to feel healthy. Now, how do you reach that, right? Go saying the goal out loud does nothing to move you towards that goal. And you have to, you actually, the, the things you have to focus on to move in a direction towards good health is the thing you need, you need to actually spend time focusing on are the systems that get you there. And one of the best systems for getting you there is to stimulate your vagus nerve. And because this system is so powerful that you can have so much faith and certainty that you just, if you just stimulate your vagus nerve on a daily basis, that everything in your life, everything in your health will start to come together like clockwork, okay? And so you no longer need to think. That's how powerful vagus nerve stimulation is. It gives you the ability to have the full faith, certainty, and confidence and guarantee that everything else will start to work itself out in the category of your body. Okay, that's how powerful vagus nerve stimulation is. Okay, you, you feel me on that? I'm, that's what I'm literally saying. But vagus nerve stimulation isn't the only system that you should be doing a, on a daily basis. Something like, you know, getting outside and walking for 20 minutes, doing the hour of power, that would be a system called moving my body in some way every day. That's a different system. Now, if you walked outside for 20 minutes every single day, that's going to move again. That's a, almost a certainty that your health in a year from now by doing that every day is going to be good versus if you just sat inside all day and you said, my goal is to be healthy, but I don't know the systems. You're not going to be healthy. That's just a goal that's never going to really come true. So that's a different type of system. So, and then another system would be eating healthy every day, right? So there's really three primary systems that vagus cure is going to give you some guidance on with a primary focus on stimulating your vagus nerve with electrical stimulation, okay? Is it the only way to stimulate your vagus nerve? No. Many of you coming in here already know how to stimulate your vagus nerve in some way, shape, or form. It may be using essential oils by rubbing it on your ear. Maybe it's humming, breathing, gargling, singing, um you know, using other devices that you might have, all those things are perfectly valid. So as long as you're stimulating your vagus nerve on a daily basis, then you are fulfilling the system of stimulating your vagus nerve daily. Now, looking at this even further, just to talk about systems, a system that says stimulate my vagus nerve daily does is so wide open that it does include things that are on a spectrum of effectiveness. So there are certain, th are there certain things, think about it, are there certain things you're doing to stimulate your vagus nerve that don't do too much for you, right? Are there things that you've, make, that you've tried in the past that you were told would stimulate your vagus nerve that had no response, zero results, right? Nod your head. You're like, yep, I've done, I've, I've read some things online that said do this and it'll stimulate your vagus nerve and it, it didn't work, right? And so we think in terms of stimulating your vagus nerve is a skill set that you get better at over time the more you operate in the system of stimulation. Just like if you're like, I want to be really good at math. Um, is, there's no goal with getting better at math. There's just getting better at math. And is, does getting better at math over time have good emergent benefits? Absolutely. You can calculate numbers faster. You can impress friends. You know, you can see how much money you expect back from the store without having to pull out your phone. Um, there are benefits to getting better at math, but nobody's walking around saying my goal is that when I get, when I pay with a 20 and I get, you know, I expect change back that I know exactly how much, that's not a goal. 
Um, no, that's not an important goal to have. Um, and who cares? So stimulating your vagus nerve is a skill building process. And so as we've talked about before, there are ways to stimulate your vagus nerve that take more than it gives. Okay. Smoking cigarettes is a form of vagus nerve stimulation because nicotine in the cigarettes stimulates through the nicotinic acetylcholinergic receptors of your vagus nerve. Nicotine doesn't look any different to your vagus nerve than normal acetylcholine, which your body naturally produces. So nicotine externally from cigarettes stimulates your vagus nerve, okay? So that would count technically as a daily system of stimulating your vagus nerve. And raise your hand if you know someone who properly does incorporate a system of stimulating their vagus nerve every day. And they're like, no, I don't need this vagus nerve stimulation. I feel fine, right? But are there better ways and worse ways to stimulate your vagus nerve? Definitely. So smoking a cigarette every day, smoking on you know a, a 20 pack of cig- cigarettes a day, and I've met people who do that every day, is not a good way to do it. And so what we're gonna present here in Vegas Cure is really probably one of the better ways to do it. It's not gonna be the best, but it's gonna be in terms of the most affordable and one of the ones that I'd feel most comfortable with someone who has no help and guidance and just wants to do this completely on their own. Just so you know, Vegas Cure comes with zero, zero support from me. This is not an impetus for you to say, hey, I need to know how to program it. All the information is there and all the support from the manufacturers is provided from this course. So if you have questions about the specific technology, you'll reach out to the manufacturer and they have people on hand who will support you with it. It's not me supporting you. It's me helping you organize the information and thinking about how vagus nerve stimulation fits into your life, okay? So that's what I'm happy to facilitate. But we we don't manufacture vagus nerve stimulation systems that stimulate the ear with electricity. We do manufacture devices that stimulate the vagus nerve with ultrasound, but that's a whole different course and that's something that you would need to have a phone call with me about before we would support you on that, just so you guys are clear, okay? So this is this is where it's this is how it's located. So the way that I want you to think about systems is first you have a system marked in yellow, and then in the description is the purpose. So I want you to be really clear on the reason why this is something to be done in your life. Okay. So as we have it written here, you can see it, and you'll all get you'll get all get the access to this. Um, through the VegasCure.com website, you'll you'll access this through a portal, is the purpose of stimulating my vagus nerve is this. When my vagus nerve gets stimulated, I feel better, healthier, happier, and my parasympathetic system gets activated and strengthened. This makes me resilient to stress, inflammation, and bolsters my entire body to handle anything that life can throw at it. How cool is that? Okay, so I'm going to put that in the chat, actually, because I think that's actually a really important concept to remember. Okay, so I'm going to paste that in the chat. Stimulate my vagus nerve daily is the system and the purpose of it, right, is as follows. Yeah, very good. So that is an important takeaway to, for you to be on board with before you move to the tasks that enable you to do that. So you'll see below is on the to-do, right? Because I'll say, okay, this is the system that you need to do. Here are some ways to go about it using electrical stimulation of the ear, okay? So we have three specific tasks listed here. You're going to find that it's distinguished based on if you're in the U.S. and Canada versus if you're in the U.K. and the E.U. So if you're in the U.S. and Canada, you're going to click on this link. Okay, now you're going to click see more and it's going to have an entire written out guide, almost like a, you know, a Google Doc, but it's in it's in it's in our software of all the instructions, all the setup, all the things you need to know about getting this handled. And so you're going to see U.S. and Canadian customers should use the intensity micro combo device. And you're going to notice here it has the tens ear clips, the microcurrent ear clips. And these are actually a very special type of device. And so I'm going to paste in the chat here for those who already have 
I'm going to do you guys a bonus because you guys are in my Facebook group and I want to really encourage people to be in the Facebook group because that's where you get all the goodies. And if you're just watching me on YouTube, come and join the Facebook group. Um, be in our Facebook group. It's where the most value is held. Um, so there's a new device. It's not a new device for stimulation. It's the new ear clip. And you can see it's actually got deeper um, rubber. So it clips on a lot softer. It doesn't have to have as much pressure. And it's already a combination device. Um, and so this is, even if you have gone through Vegas Cure already, you should go and get these. Just guess how much those cost. And if you go into the if you go in the course and you click it, it will open up the page to the website and you can go and order them already. I've ordered a number for myself, for friends, this kind of stuff, for just for, you know, people who are like, hey, I you know, I want to try this ear clip thing. Just if I have any offhand and they need it, I can just have them. And, you know, just for me to experience it. And so the the company there is a reputable, vetted company, and it's ten dollars for that ear clip. There's no reason, there's no excuse why if you're gonna go through the Vegas Cure system that you shouldn't have that. And then here is the intensity micro combo device that you should also order, okay? And so the link is found there, all right? So that's for US customers, US and Canadian customers. And then up here on the right-hand side, you see where my mouse is shaking. There's a little X and you can close that window. And then we can go and see that there's a UK EU customer Okay, so I'm gonna click on that. So for EU custom for UK and EU customers, there is another device. However, you can still order these ear clips now from they come from Europe. So if you're in the UK or Europe, you should also order these uh, ear clips. And also, if you're in the UK, one of the better premier tens and muscle stimulators devices that can be programmed at a very low intensity. So even though it says tens, it's digital which allows you to specifically program at a very low intensity. That's the reason these have to be digital is because if you stimulate your ear with too much electricity, which is what those old little clicky $16, $30, $10, 7000 devices would do, you would get reports of people overstimulating and actually damaging their ear with electricity. You can actually cause you can actually cause really bad things if you're overstimulating your nerves. Believe it or not, you guys. Believe it or not. If you are dealing with medical technology and stimulating your vagus nerve with the inappropriate equipment, you can actually cause very severe life-threatening issues. Go figure, okay? So when people say, oh, I just have a 10, tens, 7,000, I'm just gonna use that instead. I say, please don't. Like if you see people saying that, you have to say, go to vaguscure.com and please, for the love of God, it's only 60 something dollars. It's your health is worth the little like the marginal extra 10, 20, 30 bucks that you're going to have to pay to get the right freaking device. Guys, amen. Raise your hand and just say amen if you're with me on that. If like 60 bucks is just too much, go ask a friend. Go get some help, all right? I don't know what to tell you, man, but you got to get the right stuff. So anyway, all the links are here for getting that. And then also we have the specific links for the stimulator if you just want to buy that separately too, right? Or the, the ear clips uh, system, okay? So there's that. That's what one system looks like. And as far as things go, the good news is this is a system that can be improved upon and built up as time goes. So when you see this right now, if you see this in a week from today, which is, you know, it's September 12th, 2022, um, uh, this is still being built out, but the core the core components are already there and ready to go. So now you're like wondering, okay, Sterling, I see, but how do I have the instructions on how to use it? Well, that's where the Vegas Cure Phase 0.5 space comes in. So if we click on this and we drop that down, you're going to see a folder that includes all the specific stages of setting this up. So it's like a mini, co it's a mini course. So on the left-hand side, you'll see right here that I went to a different location, and now this is framed a little bit differently, which is just this is the information. So what we're going to do here is click on the very first video task, which is called Overview of the Vegas Cure Course. Read information by clicking here. If we click on this, then we're going to click See More, and you're going to see a written-out guide on what this is. It's a fully written-out system, and it's going to explain to you 
how the course is going to work. So then you click close, close window, and then you click on the next one. Programming and setting up the intensity micro combo unit instructions inside. There's the unpacking video, how to turn on the device, how to set it up, where to where to clip it to your ear, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So all the information is all listed out here, right? So you can never tell me that I haven't provided a really incredible amount of information. Here's the video on how to do for for UK US customers. There's an actual video detailing exactly how to program the MedFit device too, okay? Where to clip it, all this kind of stuff, okay? And there's more than just that. There's another, there's a better location on clipping the ear. So there's the, there's for the older clients who, uh, for the older uses of Vegas Cure who didn't, who, who got the old um, ear clips that were unconnected, you have to do them in two separate locations on the ear. Um, but with the new ear clip version, you can clip it on the ear and it looks like this. It's all combined in one stack and that gets you better focus on the vagus nerve and you're not getting off target stimulation, which is really cool. That location is called the concha. Okay. And you can see references of the ear. So nothing in here will be too complex. Um, then we have what's called the full protocol. So we have where, when, and why to stimulate full protocol inside. Read this for the full instructions put together into one place, okay? So we're going to talk about when to stimulate once or twice per day. Reachers, reachers, researchers um, have shown that the downsides of electrical stimulation through the ear is that because of the high in sensitivity of the ear to high current stimulation, you cannot turn the intensity up too much. So this directly translates into why you need to use the device for much longer, meaning hours at a time and you know, spreading it out into multiple times a day um, than using something like an ultrasound device, which doesn't cause pain and can be used for maybe two to five minutes. People in the chat will, you know, can attest to the huge difference between electrical stimulation of the ear versus ultrasound stimulation of the vagus nerve. So, but like I said, this is the phase 0 0.5. And so without having to really spend much money or investing much, you can still experiment with with electrical stimulation of your ear along with the the pros and the cons the downsides that electrical stimulation entails but this phase 0 0.5 course will help you work around all of the downsides to electrical stimulation in preparation hopefully that you may decide to opt in to upgrade into a paid full guided course where you get software that's way more robust than this but this just gets you prepared for what some of the next steps are. And would I recommend ultrasound? Yeah, I would definitely. Do. If you like, if you like what's in Vegas Care, then you should join Vegas Hub. You should get into a Phase One program, a full Phase One program. Um, but this is more than enough for what you need. Um, so there we go. And then there's so there's kind of like I look at this as month one or stage one, stage two, stage three. Um, uh, uh, good news. Good news generally is that you can do it by a, on a month to month basis. So you can do stage one in one month, stage two in one month and stage three in one month. So it could be a two to three month program for you. And that will give you enough time to really make the most out of it. And then the next thing is, you know, next thing is we're going to talk about there's videos in here as well that are embedded right here. So you can watch them. And you can learn more about vagus nerve stimulation. So there's a lot of information in this course that will help you not only get stimulation of your vagus nerve done, but it will also help you kind of get a sense for what's next. Like what could be some of the potential pitfalls that you might encounter if you're stimulating too much, if you're not stimulating enough. When you start stimulating your vagus nerve, you're going to notice that your emotions start being felt more. So wouldn't it be nice to know to have someone give you information to prepare you for what that might look like, right? And so Vegas Cure includes all of that corollary important next step information because oftentimes you're left kind of just, you know, you're not going to be able to go ask the manufacturer of the microcurrent device or the MedFit like, hey, I've been using the device and when I watched this Disney movie, I've never cried for years. I started crying. What does that mean? You know, the manufacturer of that device, which isn't me, 
the manufacturer of that device isn't going to be able to answer to that, right? So the benefit of something like a Vegas Cure program versus any other kind of place to go get this information is that we know what your trajectory looks like over years of stimulating your vagus nerve. So wouldn't it, would you rather have someone who's just like, yeah, just use this and good luck, or someone who's like, I know what month one, six months will look like, nine months, one year, two years, and three years into the future will look like when you're going to start stimulating your vagus nerve. I've now been stimulating my vagus nerve since 2016. It was the very first time I stimulated my vagus nerve with ultrasound in my ear. And, you know, pretty incredible pretty incredible experience. And so, um, but you know, the ultrasound system that I used in back in 2016 is a $20,000 system. So, you know, if you want to, if, if, if you're of the financial, uh, wherewithal and you want to, if you want to engage on that level with me and get access to the $20,000 ultrasound system that stimulates your ear, that's used in clinic, you know, in research and, and, and used, uh, in a, in a number of different locations in our retreats, then, you know, feel free to reach out, right? I'm not going to say no, but um, if you're looking for something that you can acquire for below $100 and have that whole system laid out for you, uh, that's all here on Vegas Cure. So doesn't that sound pretty cool? Um, so yeah, um, how this, so how this is going to work is if you go to VegasCure.com, you're still going to log in, and within the login, you're going to get the initial video instructions, and then you're going to access this dashboard through a portal and that's going to enable you to, to um, have this information in a very easy to digest, organized fashion. And just to just to review, what I showed you here is the Vegas Cure system. Essentially, it's a systems dashboard. It's software. And what I found is that you know why I'm doing this is that in the past I used to think of myself as like I'm a Vegas nerve coach. And really, what I've realized more and more is that. I'm really the CEO of a software company. This is a software as a service. It's a SaaS company. And basically what we're doing here by using this system is getting you to think cognitively, changing kind of your the ability for your brain to comprehend and simplify and narrow down and be focused on action rather than be lost in overwhelm of how to how to incorporate what could be the most important aspect of your healthcare into your daily systems. We want to find a way to make stimulation of your vagus nerve fit into your life because stimulating your vagus nerve should not come at the expense of everything else, right? I I've heard stories of people going, "Well, I bought in to the fact that the vagus nerve is important, but nobody gave me any any, you know, um, uh, gutters on the left and the right. If you've ever gone bowling, you know, you can't just throw the bowling ball across the room and, and hit a strike. There are gutters and bumpers on the left and the right side that keep your ball contained. And so I want you to have a straight shot. I want you to get, I want you to have vagus nerve stimulation be as powerful and as effective and as optimized for the purpose of what we're looking at here, which is to improve parasympathetic system activation and strengthening so that you can be resilient to stress, resilient to inflammation, and it can bolster your entire body to handle anything that life can throw at it, okay? So if that sounds good to you, then VegasCure.com is a fully-fledged, fully-optimized system. It's not like anything is technically super new, but there are some small aspects of it that I think make make it lo make it worth logging into yet again and really accessing this information for yourself. But also knowing that what I would like you to do is to go into the dashboard and then also to um, to go into the dashboard, even if you've gone through the program already and get the upgraded ear clip, right? Go into the dashboard, get the ear clip, even if you are already using some form of a vagus nerve stimulation with electricity, okay? Um, so, uh, very cool, very, very excited, very proud of what we've created, um, and that should be accessible. By the time this video goes live on YouTube, you'll be able to watch this. Um, and so, um, so yeah, that's, that is the relaunch of Vegas Cure. You know, I wish I had some 
some more fanfare here for you guys and I had some like, you know, confetti to 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 shoot in the air, but I would if I could. I just don't want to have to vacuum up after that and think it's kind of I can think it's kind of gimmicky. So anyway, going back to just me, um, that will wrap it up for the demonstration of the relaunch of the Vegas Cure uh, product. So I'm um, really excited about that. I see. I just want to go to the chat here real quick and just see. Uh, we did get some amens and thumbs up. Thank you. Um, so glad I didn't get a product that was shown at the flea market yet. Yeah, I mean, honestly, if you're trying to buy a product at a flea market for stimulating your vagus nerve, I mean, I don't know. Rose, you can do better. I'm just going to I'm just going to say um, um, I'm glad you also didn't get a product that you were shown at a flea market yet. Yes. OK. Awesome updates. Thanks so much. I just ordered new Eclipse as the ones I self made and I had to glue together. Sucked. Yeah. I mean, hey, come on. Let's be fair. They were pretty good. And, and when the course was created in 2019, that new product didn't exist. And so I was like, all right, I need to upgrade the course. But could I make an upgrade for the Vegas Cure that wasn't just a minor, like, here's a new link to the ear clips. What if I could just make a radical shift and make it 10 times better? And I think we've definitely accomplished that. Um, very cool. So Lori does sound very cool. Um, we have a question here uh, related to all this. Question, if you're doing Q&A, I am doing Q&A. Um, how did one cha damage their vagus nerve in the first place? Let's say if they didn't have trauma or physical damage, could it be damaged from something that was digested or inhaled or some other way? Could it be damaged genetically or born that way? So it could be genetic. Genetics do, do play a factor. Nature, nurture, definitely a factor. Um, your brain can damage your vagus nerve. You can think your way into, into vagus nerve dysfunction. You see people who are like hypochondriac and just like keeping themselves ramped up, amped up in this state of fear all the time. That will damage your vagus nerve. And think of it like this, like, um, have you ever seen some, have, okay, I want you to picture in your mind two types of people, two men, one who's never been to the gym and see how skinny and scrawny and weak they are. And then I want you to see another man next to them who goes to the gym five days a week and really hits it hard, not using steroids, but just really hits the, the gym hard. Okay. So compare and contrast a really skinny, little scrawny dude, an adult who may have a beer, but beer, but beer belly or a gut or whatever, however you want to see them. And then I want you to see that next to a strong dude with six pack abs, a really strong neck and muscles. Now I want you to see I want you to see them get into a, a, a match. They're the same size, same weight. One's just made out of fat and skin and bones, and then the other one's made out of sheer muscle. I want you to see them start going at it and fighting. Which one wins better, okay? So the one that's strong is going to win, obviously. That's just, just a fact. So think of it like this. You could, would, if it, it would be weird to, to look at the skinny, scrawny dude the weak man, and say that his muscles are damaged, right? You don't typically say to a, a, a skinny little person that their muscles are damaged. But if you, if you frame it like this, that a muscle or a part of your body, a, a key part of your bodily function that has been unutilized for years looks deteriorated, right? You look, it's not that you're skinny, it's that you don't look strong like you should. The ideal body is a body that has muscles on it, that's strong, the American body type that is fat and riding around in a, in a scooter is not the ideal body type, okay? There's something wrong with that. Quote me on that. There's something wrong, okay? So you, I would say that a skinny body is in some way damaged, okay? Now, I'm not being, I'm not saying, well, if you had an illness, you had polio, I'm not talking about that kind of thing. Somebody who had every opportunity to go to the gym, but just chose not to, either out of will, willful ignorance or for whatever reason, they just never, never were encouraged by, you know, maybe their family had no culture of ex exercise. So you would say that is a familial, hereditary trait that they incorporated from their parents. So they're skinny because their parents didn't encourage them to exercise. I would bet that their parents also look similar in body type to how their kid looked, okay? So that body type, 
that looks skinny and weak is a damaged body type, okay? Because they did not use the muscles, the neurons, the strength, the potential that they had given to them. That's damage. That is damage. That is a damaged person. And I could guarantee you that it's not just their body that's damaged, it's their mind that's damaged. Weak people are damaged people if they've been weak by choice. If you look, if you got some kind of an autoimmune condition and it, it put you off on your ass and you've been in bed and sick and tired, this is not this this is not me saying that you're damaged in that way out of the choice to not exercise, okay? A strong body is a strong body. It's a healthy body, right? Nobody looks at someone with muscles and says, wow, that person looks like really sick. They must have a lot of like sickly bodily issues. No, you have to have a strong, healthy body to maintain muscles. So the same thing applies with your vagus nerve. I want you to listen really carefully. You all had a vagus nerve from day number one, from the day you were born. You all had a vagus nerve. It was your parents who taught you strategies. Maybe they didn't say, hey, Rose, I want you to go and start lifting weights at the gym. I was encouraged to lift weights at the gym when I was a kid, and it was a really good thing. My mom encouraged me to have practices of body strengthening, okay? She put my ass to work, all right? And I'm grateful for it, um, okay? Some parents didn't. My mother didn't teach me things like breathing or self-regulation. I would say arguably so. My mom does have some traits that her mother gave her, my grandmother gave her, of getting upset in a situation that's not going your way and responding in a kind of very uncomfortable, domineering way. My mom was a very domineering person. And I can be that way too with people in my life. And that's a byproduct of a hereditary cultural and nurture aspect of how my vagus nerve works. And so now as an adult, recognizing that having a good vagus nerve is that I had to go and just simply learn how to make this happen in my life. It's no longer an option for any of you listening here to be willfully ignorant of strength and, of practices that strengthen your vagus nerve, knowing what it can do for you, right? It's the same thing of saying like, yeah, yeah, I know that if I went and, and I, if I bought some 5, 10, 15 pound weights and I started trying to lift, do bicep curls, that my biceps would become big. If I started doing neck strengthening with the iron neck, that my neck would become robust and strong. You, none of you have the excuse anymore to be willfully ignorant. Now, do, will you have resistance if, you're, if your parents never encourage that? If you live with people in your environment who don't exercise? If you live with people who don't value bodily strengthening practices like strength training or running or exercise, then that's going to have an effect on you in real time. And it's the exact same thing for your vagus nerve, folks. So yeah, Rose, if you if there's no clear-cut example of, you know, I didn't, you know, if you say to yourself, I never had Lyme, I never had mold toxicity, I wasn't poisoned, I never was in a whiplash injury, I have no uh, none of the clinical, like, signatures, or I never had a surgery, or I never had any number of the things that can really say this damaged your vagus nerve. And maybe you say, well, maybe I was born that way. I don't really believe you were born that way. I believe that you were just born into an environment that never taught you about the vagus nerve, right? There's a reason why this group is now 20,000 people, right? If everybody already knew everything about the vagus nerve and there was nothing else that I could add to their lives in terms of education, this group would have, you know, stayed at a couple people back in whatever, 20, 2018 when I opened it up, okay? So there's clearly a need to learn about this kind of stuff. There's clearly a need to learn about neck strengthening, clearly need to learn about gut microbiome, gut health, um, and so we're teaching that. So yeah, you didn't need to have childhood trauma. You didn't need to have physical damage. You might have just not gone to the gym. You might not have gone to the vagus nerve gym. You maybe just never strengthened your vagus nerve at all. And what ha what's a natural consequence of not using something 
is it's not like a you know it's not like if i buy a book and i put it on the shelf it collects dust your body your biological systems literally fall apart and get eaten up and recycled to be used in other places that you're putting your energy and focus into so admit it to yourself raise your hand if in your life you've you've put focus attention time and effort and energy into building things in your life that weren't serving you maybe it was overeating maybe it was being depressed maybe it was focusing on you know things in your life that you didn't like maybe it was sitting on your ass maybe your body decided that instead of building your vagus nerve it would build your ass bones so you could sit on your ass and do nothing for hours a day admit it we've all done it because if you use it then you're going to grow it and if you don't use it you're going to lose it so most of you if you're like i have i think i have a vagus nerve issue but none of the things that you say are big common problems can explain why my vagus nerve is working you not using your vagus nerve and not even knowing what it is is a probably a root cause of why it's not working just like the skinny guy is skinny because he didn't use his muscles. Whereas the, the strong person has strong muscles because they went and they strengthened their muscles. It's the same thing with your vagus nerve, okay? All right, good. All right, so let's get off of our asses or still stay on your ass and do some vagus nerve stimulation, okay? Um, great. Do, 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 do. Um, no, yeah, Becky... Um, uh, so how the vagus cure works is it's accessible to the general public and it will not become something that you have in your workspace. So as a, as a client of mine, um, uh, phase one is just accessible through the website. It won't impact your, it won't impact you at all. It's not going to get loaded into your account. It's a completely separate thing. So don't worry about it. All you'll need to do Becky and it will, you'll, it'll just, it'll work itself out. Um, you just go to VegasCured.com and you'll log in and you'll you'll be able to access the Vegas Cured dashboard, but it will be completely separate. And just how it works is my team is not assigned to Vegas Cure because when Vegas Cure goes live later today, it's going to be accessible by a thousand people in one dashboard. Becky, your dashboard that you have is accessible by myself, you, and our support people. It's a very intimate. So if you write a comment, I see it, we'll respond to it, and I have some things I need to respond to you uh, today. Um, with Vegas Cure, there's no commenting, there's no support, it's provided as is, and we're not. I'm not gonna be waking up to a thousand support messages on Vegas Cure. So it's a very different, it's basically like, Becky, so you're in phase one, uh, Laura, you're in phase two, your dashboards are modifiable you you have admin editing access as a client in phase one in vegascure.com it's sort of a it's sort of a read-only version of the dashboard you're only going to go in there and view it you can't click any buttons to complete things you're not going to be able to go you know it's like that it's tightly controlled because i don't want people who are trolls going into vegas cure and start writing in nasty comments Okay, because it's now going to be accessible to thousands of people all at once. And so it's locked. It's completely locked down. So I'm the only one who can edit it. I'm the only one who can change it. You're just going to be able to go and look at it. Just like any of the documents I send, like a Google Doc, you know, the parasympathetic one with the hour of power. You'll notice that's all the information, but it's read only. It doesn't give you commenting access. It doesn't give you um, anything. So that's kind of how Vegas Cure works. Vegas Cure is a very uniquely designed, publicly accessible, view only locked version of a course. Make sense? It's cool. Um, so Rose says, however, from my path of study, and like you said, it has been progressive and naturally has now led me to this avenue, but all you have, but you have all of it here in this program, although I have not heard you mention moving that lymph. Uh, yeah, I mean, Rose, the thing is, I don't have to mention something for it to still be part of it. You know, I don't want you to, I don't want you thinking that I'm like some, if, if I don't, if I don't explicitly say like, go do hyperbaric oxygen therapy and spend $10,000 a year on it, that I don't like it. But again, vagus cure is about how to stimulate your vagus nerve with electrical ear clips on your ear for, you know, around 
less than a hundred bucks, right? Um, so, right, be fair here, right? If I don't say moving the lymph, it doesn't mean I don't think it's important. You should go do it. Please go do move your lymph. Uh, Deborah, thanks. I need to hear this. Awesome, hitting the nail on the head. Awesome, I love it. That's that's me. I use too much ass bones. Hell yeah, totally. I've done it too, guys. I've done it too. Um, uh, personal study as I see it. It's a personal study course. Absolutely. Um, it's not, it's, you got the URL wrong. It's Vegas cure one word.com. Boom. I'm just going to remove your comment because people are going to indicate that cure.com is the website. It's Vegas cure.com. Um, so if you go there right now, it's still going to be the old thing. I haven't made it live yet. I just want to make sure I have put the final touches on it, but just so you guys know, um, by the end of today, that will be a live uh, course. So I'm really pretty stoked about that. Um, but yeah, for, for right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the YouTube video. And so everybody watching on YouTube, thanks so much for watching. I hope that was helpful. Um, send this to a friend. Send this to a, a person who wants to know about auricular vagus nerve stimulation in a self-study course. It comes with zero support. If you want support from a real person, Recognize that real people have rent to pay, real people who want to get in there and support you and answer your questions when you're using medical technology cost me money. So Vegas Cure is provided as a non-support uh, resource from me. I'm not supporting you. You have to reach out to the manufacturer of the device because the main question that's always going to happen is, well, I bought the MedFit device. How do I program it? Or what kind of batteries does it take? I'm not going to answer those questions for a thousand people. Okay. Just so we're clear. I am not even going to allow questions in the main 20,000 person Facebook group of hi, you know, you'll see these sometimes and I just delete them because they're hi, I bought the intensity unit. How do I put 15 Hertz into it? I'm like, the answers are in the course. I don't need 20,000 people seeing these questions because not all 20,000 people really care. Um, and honestly, I find it to be one of the most boring exercises that makes me pull out my hair when I'm like, I wrote it in the course. It's there. It's a free course. The support is from the manufacturer because some people may use a different device. There's a med fit. There's an intensity. You should reach out to the manufacturers of those devices and ask them. I'm providing Vegas cure as a harm reduction course because if you go to other courses they're going to give you a quick google doc that say hey here's a 10 7000 unit i guess their main objective is how do i get someone a, an electrical stimulator for as cheaply as possible but as you know when it comes to your medical care how successful is saying to yourself i want the cheapest thing possible to stimulate my vagus nerve I mean, the difference between following a Vegas Cure protocol and following a cheap ass 10, 7,000 old school unit from the 80s is the difference of about maybe $20 versus $60. $20 versus $60 when the $20 system can hurt you severely, whereas the, the $60 system is designed with vagus nerve stimulation and auricular stimulation in mind. So... You know, again, it's just a bad system. If part of your systems is, and make sure it's the cheapest thing possible, that is a that is a bad strategy for life, okay? Very bad strategy for life. Try something that's safe, that's scientifically validated, um, you know, that's that's affordable enough within the budget that I have. And if it's something that I that is a little bit outside of my budget, 60 bucks, is it outside your budget? Maybe. Can I, is there a friend that I could comfortably ask, hey, you know, there's this device. I really believe in this. I'll give you access to the course too. Um, it's something that I need. And I'm really just in a tough spot right now with the increase in prices of groceries and stuff. Um, but I really think it would be something that would really help me. Um, you know, can we go half, half on it? We can share it. I don't know, right? Something like that, 60 bucks, it's so easy. I think the device is $69 on the website or whatever. And you can probably find some little discount code. I think there is a discount code actually save five. I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to show you something cool just how, how, so I can show you how I can use it. And the reason this is beneficial is 
any updates I make in the account, you'll see live updated. That's another benefit. So I'm just going to once more go back into the um, into the system and I'm going to do this. I'm going to say, so where we click on here and we go for US Canada customers and I'm going to go back down here. So where we have the link is use code save five to save five percent. Boom. Okay. So then I'm going to close it and it's going to auto update for everybody. Okay. So boom. Now when you see that, you'll see that little comment in your account and it'll be there. So how cool is that? So any updates I make are, are live. Not, it's not going to, it's not going to email you that I updated the code because it would email a thousand people every time I did that. It's there now for the future and any updates that I make, I'll, if I make any big announcements, I'll, of course, make an if I make any big changes, I'll make an announcement. Um, but yeah, other than that, um, it's a great system. I'm really excited for you to get into it. And then just know if you come into a phase one program, we use a very similar process. So your your mind and your your level of understanding will perfectly work for the ultrasound based system. Um, and it's just awesome. It's so cool. And it's a lot more robust. Obviously, this is a pared down course to be as much as you need as something that you could really ideally cover within about a one to two to three month process. There's only so much you can do in two months with your vagus nerve, guys. Um, so is there is there more stuff that I know about the vagus nerve that is not in the vagus cure course? 100%. Is the, is the purpose of Vegas Cure to be a repository for literally everything that I've ever said about the vagus nerve at all? No. Vegas Cure is specifically about incorporating a, tran, a cu, transcutaneous auricular electric vagus nerve stimulation clip ear system using a specific piece of equipment. That is the primary objective and vision and system of Vegas Cure. Um, with the intention of it will bring you up to speed. You're going to cover it for about one to two months, maybe a third month. And then by that point, you will most likely be more than ready to upgrade into a better system. Okay. Awesome. I hope that's clear. I, you know, I feel like I over, over say some things, but I, you know, I think more information is better in these, in these, in, the, in these situations. Um, okay, cool. So anyway, thanks for watching on YouTube like comment subscribe on the video below if you're excited check the description for the link directly to vegascure.com um, and that'll be it so thanks everybody on youtube and take care bye bye